Hi everybody, my name is Adam, skipping the intro again. <clears throat> a little bit of a food for thought. A video. A little thought piece if you would like to take it into account. It's been a little while since I did one, but... Whew. I want to cover the crazy. Crazy. The Iranian vegan Muslim feminist that shot up YouTube headquarters. Okay, story is as it goes. It doesn't fit, fit, you know, like the mainstream media's uh, <clears throat> narrative either, and they like just try to you know, like bury it. Well, she was this Misa, whatever I'll probably butcher her last name. The side too was angry about her algorithm. She goes to YouTube's offices. Yeah, you know, goes purchases purchases um, an AR-15. Oh God! Goes to a shooting range. Walks up there. Yeah, you know, goes up there with the gun. And shoots three people, then takes her own life. And this chick was... And, you know, like... Uh, she was getting less and less views as time went on. I didn't even, you know, like... Hear about this person or anything, you know, like... Because uh, people like John Sacros and... Uh, the... Period Blood bather, you know, like, people like that are way more entertaining to watch and laugh at of their insanities. Well, this is the whole thing is that, man, I don't know what caused it, maybe because veganism, because of the whole you know, like diet and stuff, you know, like lack of essential proteins and stuff causes <coughs> B12 deficiency. And when B12 deficiency kicks in, you get depressed, you're thinking homicidal or suicidal thoughts and shit like that. And she hit, her only friend was a, was her rabbit. Yeah, and this person and that's kind of sad, you know, like, and depressing to have, you know, like, a friend that's a little animal and no human interaction. Uh, I take pity on the poor lady in a sense, you know, like, and the whole thing is, my whole thing is, I don't give a shit about views. You know, like, shit, I, I think I'm the bastard ass child of... Mr. Medicur and Nurkish combined. It, and do you think I give a shit if I get one, two, three, four, five views or five fucking thousand? No, I don't. I do it as fun as a independent journalist. And for my enjoyment and if I may entertain, make people laugh. I fucking love doing that. Because I always throw in a comedic spin to it. And with the comedic spin, I just like throw my like opinions in too with facts. And make fun of like say if there's some crazy loony comics pro losing their shit on Twitter. Which, oh, 
which will be coming up in a special video. Uh, soon. With two no names attacking somebody. That's been in the industry for years upon years upon years and upon. Oh, he was doing shit when I was growing up, so in the 1980s and 90s, he's a writer. Howard Chainton. And, you know, like, other people have covered it, why the fuck not? You know, like, because this shit is just golden. On um, these two, you know, like, unknown, out of work, People there are basically never has, not even has been, so never was in the industry. So if there never was, fuck it, in their public figure, attack them. You know, like, that's the way I do shit on this channel. I report objectively, throw some jokes in it, some humor, don't get involved in the drama. And make fun of the person that's losing their mind. <clears throat> because insanity is a funny thing to make fun of. Yeah, and that's all I have to say for now. Until next time. Have a good day. Subscribe if you like my content. I don't give a fuck about likes or anything. Leave a comment down below. And I hope you enjoyed this like little knowledge nugget and shit. And until next time, I will see you around. Have a good day. Stay safe. I'm signing off. And be good to each other. <coughs>